What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Neville. I'm here doing a review for today's product that I just picked up today at Sam Ash. It's going to be the Studio Project B1 condenser microphone. You can see right here. Um, this is the retail box that it came out of. Um, it was priced retail for $119 out the door. And here's the box. Here's the lid. Looks like a almost like a shoe box. Just a picture of the mic outside. This is the B series. It's the B1 condenser microphone. Here's my receipt. Studio projects. It's gonna be the manual. No, actually, it's the. It's gonna be the warranty. It has the registration on there. It's always good to register your products for that warranty. If anything goes wrong as far as uh, like product failure, part failures, they'll go ahead and cover it. You would have to read more into it depending on how long the coverage is on that microphone. And then here's going to be when you open the box. You got the little leather pouch. Has the stamped logo on there. Studio projects. And it comes with the the wind guard. A shock mount. Comes with a bag of uh, two bands in there. And of course, the microphone. B1. It has the high pass filter in the front. Oh, actually, the back side of it, sorry. Um, it has flat, it has the cutoff at 75, and then at 150. And then in the front, it has the SP logo. And it has the pads on there. Minus 10 dB and minus 20 dB, if you need that. It has the outside layer mesh, and it has an inside layer mesh, too. And I don't know if you could see that, but... the the little diaphragm in there is probably like about I would say like about that big it's a pretty heavy mic in my opinion on the design this is like a black pla plastic piece I would rather have seen that maybe metal but the quality is actually looks pretty good solid And then here's the inside of the box. It has it's really hard foam. That's about it. And I looked it up on the website for the technical specifications. It's a cardioid, of course. It's a one inch single diaphragm. It's a FET, a FET, three micron, um, twenty to twenty thousand hertz. Um, it's a native 34 decibel sensitivity, uh, 200 ohm output. The max SPL is 132 decibels, 12 decibel noise ratio. Um, signal to noise, it's 82. Um, I already told you about the TAD, the pad, minus 10 and minus 20 dB. Um, there's low cuts on there. 
Um, of course, you need uh, phantom power for this one, 48 volts. Um, you can get it through your, your interface. Um, XLR, transformless circuit. It's uh, low noise and it has uh, that dynamic range. So overall, it's going to be pretty good for vocals and I would say instruments. I'll later on post another video as far as me giving examples of maybe a vocal and a acoustic guitar, but that'll be another video. So um, yeah, here's just the review, the unboxing of the SPB1 cardioid condenser microphone.